dear learners today i will show a fabric this is a very simple fabric and this is known as one by one rib but the fabric contains lycra so we can learn about lycra fabric also uh, first of all right here the fa uh, face of the fabric this is f and this one is back face fabric which remains on the outer periphery of the circular cylinder during production is known as face side and the inner side of the fabric tube is known as technical back or back side of the fabric now i have already marked a, a wells here to identify the loop in this position and this will be the starting point of our uh, diagrammatic, diagrammatic notation drawing this is a point paper in this paper we will draw the notation from the fabric loop identification so we can start by unraveling the yarn one by one and identify the loop which loops are present in this fabric so i can use this two finger as a clip and these two finger other clip so that I can grip the fabric tightly the two horizontal row of loops in this fabric these are the back loop row and these are the face loop row so there are two rows of loops in this fabric so this fabric is double jersey fabric and the position of loops are alternate so this fabric is rib fabric it is very much clear that these loops are placed in an alternate manner this one is face loop and this one is back loop face back face back face back so this is a rib fabric and the loop is placed one by one so it is known as one by one rib fabric one face loop and back loop one face and another is back face back face back it will be more clear when i start the unraveling now face loop and then back loop again face loop in the colored wells it is back again face so we can draw the notation starting from back loops so this is a paper point paper one two back loop face back back face back face second course back face back the and then face again back face back face back face back face back face so in the mark starting mark start or starting position so again back loop face loop back loop face loop back and face the third course same as the previous one but there is a there is another yarn this is the lycra yarn with the cotton yarn lycra yarn is this is lycra yarn coming from the fabric with the cotton yarn so third one is lycra lycra yarn so we can
start or oh, like here yeah? you can draw this way again cotton yarn same as the previous one again cotton so we can draw the fourth one and then fifth in case of fifth yarn like ray is also coming so in case of fifth yarn this course content like here so you can use the black pen and draw the course so every odd number course contains like a yarn and the even number courses do not contain any like a yarn so we can say that the fabric is half feeder like a rib like a plain rib or one by one rib half feeder like a one by one rib now we have to identify the repeat of the structure every course is similar to the previous so we can identify the repeat every course is repeat this is the repeat or one by one rib structure one course but two wells this is the wells and this is another wells and then this is third wells and fourth wells fifth wells so this area contains two wells so i have write down here two wells and one course is the repeating unit of a rib structure but in case of uh, half feeder like a rib we can point out the repeating unit that this will be repeating unit for one by one like a rib because the fabric contains like a in alternate feeder if there are 32 feeder in the machine 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 10 every feeder will contain cotton cotton but in case of lycra only odd number of feeder will contain these are the feeder number This is the feeder one two three four five six seven eight nine ten. Only number one will contain lycra. Number three will contain cotton plus lycra. Will contain lycra and seven will contain lycra and nine L for lycra. And this is an arrangement for lycra and feeding. in every odd number feeder thank you very much for watching this video 
next time we will meet in another video